Another dimension of strangeness was that these fakerisms were spoken not by the fourth doctor, but by a marvellous gangly fellow called David Tennant, who looked more like the young Morrissey than Tom Baker, though he made his eyes wide and globular at every opportunity. David Tennant's sparkling Doctor Who had a contemporary classless accent of the kind spoken by modern ministerial warmongers. It was like listening to Tony Blair reciting the speeches of Winston Churchill. Someone lent Matthew a DVD with a two-part serial about a library. Then he saw a dark thriller directed by Graham Harper called The Waters of Mars, which culminated in a suicide. And he saw, finally, the end of David Tennant. It was all very enjoyable. Matthew had never seen an episode of the old series he had not enjoyed, and now it seemed to be the same with the new one. 